Hey everybody, how y'all doing? Back with another product review. And today we're taking a look at the Marley Bluetooth waterproof speaker. Now I'm gonna tell you right up front, for under $25, this is a really solid, really good sounding Bluetooth speaker. So let's jump right into what you came to see. The gadget is Now the speaker is advertised with an IPX7 rating which basically means that it's waterproof up to depths of 30 meters or about 100 feet uh, for about 30 minutes at a time. Now I haven't actually tested that because it's not actually something that I would actually use it for or actually do. Now I have used it uh, in the shower, you know, I've hung it up there in the shower and it definitely handles that uh, perfectly fine. Now let's take a look at the build quality. This thing definitely feels and looks tough and rugged. It's got these rivets on here uh, and it just, just feels solid, well built. I feel like if I dropped it, it would still keep on ticking. And since all of the buttons are flat here, uh, everything is pretty much flush on the body. It's just really compact. so. I feel like I can hang it up anywhere or toss it in a backpack without any trouble, without worrying about anything sticking out or getting damaged or buttons falling off or anything like that. Now it's not real big. It's actually a little smaller than my iPhone um, 6S Plus. Let's see if I can hold this up so you can see it. See that? So it's, uh, it's not real big. But it actually puts out really good sound and we'll, uh, I'll let you judge for yourself uh, in a second here. Okay, so you have your volume buttons on the top there, which doubles as your um, forward and back buttons. You've got pause and play, which is also how you answer phone calls. And then you've got the power button uh, and those are all on the top. You also have uh, a little pinhole microphone there as well. And then on the side, you have the micro USB port and the auxiliary uh, cable port. And both uh, micro USB and auxiliary cables are included in the box. And this rubber flap here protects those ports from water. Uh, so you won't get any water in there. You just push this closed and it should stay flush there. Okay, so aside from build quality and aesthetics, the most important thing that we want out of a Bluetooth speaker is good sound. So let's, uh, let's check that out. Now, I personally think this speaker delivers in that regard, but let's get it connected and I'll let you judge for yourself. Okay, so to pair the device and get it all set up for use, you're just gonna hold down the power button for about three seconds and you will hear it power up. You'll see the blue LED flashing. Uh, that, that indicates that it is uh, in pairing mode. And then you're just gonna go over to the settings uh, in your device and locate the Bluetooth signal. And there it is, it's Z gear. And just push on that. And we should get, yep, should get feedback, that little uh, chime sound indicating that you're paired up. Okay, so let's go ahead and get some music going and see how this thing sounds. Now, when I first turned this thing on, this was my reaction. What? I was really surprised at how good it sounded. And I think it was really the, the bass, the amount of bass that it was putting out really, really surprised me. All right, let's go ahead and uh, hit up some Chooky Beats, uh, one of my favorites. So let's, uh, let's check it out, shall we? Chooky Beats. All right, let's get some volume. I'm gonna um, I'm gonna turn it all the way up. I don't know if you can see this, <laughs> but the bass is causing it to move on its own. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. <laughs> yes, sir. Under 25 bucks. I might have to go ahead and do a freestyle over here. <laughs> Yo, they call me the gadget inspector. I'm here doing reviews every day of the year. 
okay, okay, okay. Just a little freestyle for y'all. All right. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and pause that. Let me uh, let me see if I can find something else. Um, <laughs> that was dope. Okay, here goes another uh, Chucky Beat uh, production here. So let's check it out. That's full volume. No distortion. Very crisp. Here come the beat. This is nuts. That bass is hitting. I'm gonna put it up to my microphone. Yeah, all right, all right, all right, that's enough, that's enough, y'all had enough. It sounds good, y'all. Okay, so the only thing that I really don't like as much about the speaker is that you can only pair it to one device at a time. So for example, if you have it paired to your smartphone and you wanna pair it to your, um, you wanna use it on your iPad or your tablet, you have to disconnect it from your phone first and then connect it with your tablet. So that's a little bit of a hassle, but not really a big deal. Other than that, I think it's definitely well worth the sub $25 price tag. Okay, so just in case I didn't convey well enough how much bass this speaker puts out, just take my advice and watch where you place it. Just keep on watching. Now, advertised playback time is about 10 hours between charges. And I have to say that's about right. I've been getting about two to three days of on and off use without having to charge. A full charge takes about an hour and a half. All right, everybody. Well, thank you so very much for stopping by, checking out my video. If you like the video, hit me with a like. Uh, if you're not a subscriber, please consider doing so. I do all kinds of gadget reviews. I'm really into quadcopters, if you don't know already. If you are currently subscribed, man, I appreciate you so very much. Uh, and check out, which side is it? This side. <laughs> check out this video. Uh, it's a, I think it's a good one. It's one of my better ones. So check that out and see if you like that one as well. All right. Well, as always, be good to somebody and be good to yourself. God bless you. And I'll see you in the next one later.